What up, everybody? Aaron for the Hammer Hanes, back again with another Bike Life product. And obviously, I can't stress enough about Ride Out Supply. And um, this time, I got another product from them. It's the Ride Out Supply C clamp. It's their signature C clamp. And it's a quick release C clamp. And I bought two. Um, one for the D blocks, red, and then one for the um, uh, SoCal Flyer, black. I wish they had an orange one or a green one, but they don't. So, no big deal. So, I just got a black one. And black goes good with um, anything. It's a universal kind of color. So, let's open it up right here and see what it is all about. If you have scissors, get scissors. Because it's tough to open this up. Very nice wrapping though. Okay. We're getting there. <laughs> So the usual cardboard, Aaron, thank you, from Maddie at Red Out Supply. So hit up Red Out Supply for all your SE Bikes accessory needs. And here it is, ladies and gentlemen. Nice seat clamps there for you. I'm gonna open up the red one and show you how to install it on the D-Block. And it comes in about several different colors, black, red, um, purple, I think, um, aluminum colored. And you can get these for about 15 bucks, I believe. I'll throw the link in the description on where you can get these from Ride Out Supply, or you can go to rideoutsupply.com Click on the accessories menu tab and um, scroll down and you'll see these. And yeah, let's open it up and see what it is all about. So there it is. The Ride Out Supply Quick Release Seat Clamp. It's perfect for when you don't want to grab your tools, um, your Allen wrench, and you have to unloosen it, raise the seat up, or um, raise it down, uh, put it back down again, tighten it again. This way, you can um, just, with the flip of the lever, you can raise your seat up or down if you like it at certain heights, or if a friend is borrowing your bike, and they like to raise the seat up or down, they can do so quickly and easily and um, without any hassle to grab your tools. And also, since, um, since um, some of, a lot of the seats on the SE bikes have that um, bottle opener under there, if your seat is low and you have a, a, a beer, you can definitely um, raise the seat up quickly with this clamp and you can open the beer quickly and then raise it back down no problem at all so let's get to it you're gonna need an allen wrench here and let's pick up the old seat and then we'll remove the uh, original clamp it up a, a lot then you can remove the seat. So there's the seat. Very nice. A little bit of um moving there. This 
might be the hard part. Take it out all the way. There you go. Comes right off once you loosen it all the way. Okay. Inspect the area around it. Maybe wipe it down a little bit. So this is the original SU bike seat clamp. It's just a standard seat clamp. Make sure, make sure when you go on rideoutsupply.com um, to order the right size um, seat clamp. There's two sizes. There's a um, smaller one and then there's the bigger one. On a lot of regular SE bikes, the smaller one is the one um, you want to get. But if you're not sure what size seat um, clamp you should get, go to sebikes.com and click on your bike and then when you scroll down on the specifications they'll tell you which seat clamp you have so how do you know which way is the top if you can read it correctly where it says ROS then that's the top so there's several different, different ways of doing this. Loosen the clamp as much as you can. So you have plenty of room. Then you just slide it on. That's it, actually. You can have it facing that way or the other way. I think the best way to do it. The best way to do it is have the um, outer, have this outer um, gap right here facing forward to the wheel. Yeah. Have it aligned a little bit. You want to align it? Sure, by all means. Okay, at that point, hand tighten the screw. And that's it. If you want to glue it on there, you can glue it on there. I might glue it on there. And that's about it. Then you can take the seat back. Perfect. Right there. And then you just align the seat. Let's see here. Perfect. And then you can now clap it on. Sometimes if it's too tight, you just only a little bit loose with the knob here. And then Boom. There it is. I like the red. It's like a uh, anodized red. It's not like a straight up candy cherry red, which would have been nice as well, just like the old one. But for it being that color red with the D blocks, I think it matches quite well. Um, I have axle nuts from TNT that are the same color as that, so 
works out perfectly. So that is the Ride Out Supply seat uh, clamp. It's a um, it's a quick release seat clamp, and um, can easily raise your seat up or down, no problems whatsoever. For about 15 bucks, I'd say it's pretty much worth it. I think it's 15 bucks. I'll throw the link in the description on where you can get this um, exact very exact same seat clamp and. Um, yeah, shout out to Rada Supply for making great accessories for my SE bikes. Um, I purchased from them many, many, many times in the past. And um, they make good spoke skins. They make good um, seats that I put on the uh, SoCal Flyer uh, from the previous videos. And um, they just make great accessories and I... I heard them through um, um, Lon Dennis for, um, from from YouTube. He's another great um, SE bikes rider. And that's gonna have to do it for this video. So if you like this uh, kind of content, don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, uh, leave a comment below. And if you have any questions, shoot me a comment below, and I'll see you in the next video.